This is the Emergency Medical Minute, sponsored by Mile High Ambulance. The Emergency Medical Minute is excited to announce that we are now offering AMA, PRA, Category 1 credits. This is accessible through our online course modules that can be accessed at www.emergencymedicalminute.org backslash CME dash courses, or simply by clicking on the link in our show notes and creating an account. All right, so uh, my medical minute is just on something that we look for on an EKG, which is the distinction between early repolarization and an anterior STEMI. It's um, one of the STEMI mimics that we always have to kind of tease out is, you know, in a young male typically is the ST elevation that is seen usually in the anterior leads is that early repol, which is benign, or are they having a STEMI? And so one of the ways that we can actually help differentiate that has been through a validated kind of uh, system. There have been uh, several studies which have shown that there are these four variables that you can factor in to determine if it's early repol or STEMI, and they are the uh, corrected QT interval, the QRS amplitude in V2, the R wave amplitude in V4, and the ST elevation 60 milliseconds after the J point in V3. And um, all that needs to be really remembered is just there is a formula for this. If you go to MD Calc and punch this in, um, you can get a pretty reliable and confident answer of does the patient have early repull or um, a STEMI. And one of the things that really um, carries a lot of weight in this is actually the QT. So basically longer QT, is more correlated with the STEMI than with early repull. So just uh, keep in mind that that is a thing. You can go to MD Calc for it and just help to distinguish the difference between early repull and uh, a STEMI. We'd like to thank our sponsor, Health One Continental Division and Swedish Medical Center for their financial contributions to the EMM. Donations from them and listeners like you make it possible for us to fulfill our mission of producing and spreading free medical education to the masses. If you enjoy our show, please consider making a one-time or reoccurring donation to help cover our operational costs and keep the EMM awesome. Click on the link in our show notes to make a donation. Thank you for listening.